Hi, it's Dwyer, gamblersadvisory.com, DwyerVIP.com. Look us up in the sports section on Roku. We're there, Dwyer Boxing and Sports News. Remember, the opinion you should follow should be your own. Just consider this video to be a second opinion from a complete stranger online. Now let's talk about a game that really should grab your attention this preseason. Not all preseason games matter. A lot of these coaches are out there trying new things, looking at third and fourth string players, protecting veterans at positions where they don't have depth. So you can take a lot of these box scores with a grain of salt, right? Certain teams know who their starter is. I don't care who's under center for the Denver Broncos. We know opening day, if he's healthy, it's going to be reigning MVP Peyton Manning. Right? You know, if I see a backup under center in a New Orleans Saints game, I'll know Sean Payton is resting Drew Brees. Right? But some of these games do matter. You need to make a note of them. Let's talk about a game that mattered greatly. It was yesterday's Houston Texan game. Right? Their blowout loss, 32 nothing to the Arizona Cardinals. Understand, they have a new coach, Bill O'Brien. Right? The question is, has the team brought into, bought into what this new guy is preaching? I believe the answer is no. Understand, there is no part of this box score that looks good. Now, I know Arizona had the best record for a team not to make the playoffs last year. I know Bruce Arians is a great coach. I know Arizona has a great defense. But wow, look at the box score, folks. Houston, for the game, had less than 10 first downs. Right? Arizona had 27. Look at the box score. Houston, for the game, had less than 200 total yards. They only had 172. Arizona had 407. Right? The other problem, too, is when you look at the box score, you know how the starters play typically in the first quarter. Right? And you know how when you're in the second half of a game, it's typically reserves. Understand, in the first quarter, Arizona outscored Houston 17 to nothing. 17 nothing. Understand, Carson Palmer, Arizona's quarterback, was not stopped. He went 5 for 5 for 84 yards and a touchdown. Understand the beatdown continued in the fourth quarter when the reserves were on the field. Arizona scored 12 points in the fourth quarter. Houston scored none. Right? Understand in terms of third down efficiency, Arizona had a greater than 50% third down efficiency rate, which is huge. They were 11 of 17. Did you know that Houston was 0 of 8 in third down efficiency. Now, in analyzing the schedules of teams, right, I thought Houston had a great schedule. Keep in mind, they're coming off of a bad season in which they had the first pick in the NFL draft, right? I don't believe Houston plays any teams that made the playoffs last year during the first month of the season. So I'm watching Houston closely this preseason. But let's just say they're already in a crisis situation. Another blowout like this on a team where guys like Andre Johnson are openly questioning the direction of the team could really pretty much put an end to the new coach's tenure. Right? If you're an owner and you have a new guy come in and the team looks this uninspired, not just offensively, but defensively, then you have problems. 
So methodical was the destruction that in terms of time of possession, think about it. Arizona had the ball more than 42 minutes. Houston yesterday had the ball less than 18 minutes. Right? This is the box score to focus on this preseason up until this point. It might be the most revealing. Bill O'Brien is going to have to change the course of the team in their very next preseason game. Otherwise, quite frankly, he risks losing the locker room. Let me hear from you. Leave your comments for me here online. Visit us at gamblersadvisory.com. Thanks for stopping by.